guys, welcome back. And if you're new here, welcome as well. So I'm going to be working my way back into doing the Marvel movies. Like I said, I know Marvel's kind of dying out a little bit, but I do kind of want to see the other movies just just to see, you know, what's going on with them. So obviously there's this giant list I need to follow. So the last Marvel movie I did was Spider-Man No Way Home, which was perfection. I loved it, loved every second of it. Um, so that was a little out of order, but now we're gonna be starting at the top of the list. So the first thing that I'm supposed to be doing is Falcon and the Winter Soldier. I know jack shit about it. Um, I always had a soft spot for Bucky, so I'm really excited to see him again. Um, but the but like the premise of it or what they're going to do, I have no idea. I guess, you know, Sam and Bucky team up and do things. <laughs> I guess that, that should be the tagline of the movie. Bucky and Sam and do things. But yeah, no, I, I literally know very little except those two are in it. And obviously Falcon, because at the end of Endgame, is taken over as Captain America. So... <laughs> That's what I'm starting off with. But like I said, I'm excited. I think it's going to be good. I haven't really heard anything negative. Um, I haven't dove too much into it. But other than that, yeah. And then I'm so sorry, but it is freezing. I don't know why I'm so cold. So <laughs> I'm wearing this. So, But without further ado, yes, here's the first episode of Falcon and the Winter Soldier. And we start out with him just ironing. Perfect. Perfect start. <laughs> oh, rest in peace, Steve. That makes me so sad to look at all the time. We need you to make sure that LAF doesn't deliver on their threat. It's Sam. This has to be subtle. <laughs> Got it. Okay, let's see how subtle he is. Oh, shit. Imagine just like chilling there, you know, with the dead body right next to you. Not even phasing you. <laughs> what do you do over that? How the fuck would he have seen him? Louis, c'est moi qui Okay. Yeah. Does Louis do that all the time? Hey! Je veux qu'il arrête de bouger. Stop his flopping. Oh shit! <laughs> okay, that's kind of cool. How did they not get completely sucked out? As soon as that door came off. Oh! Hit your own guy, dude. I love how the door being open is doing absolutely nothing. It's not affecting them whatsoever. Got me for sauce? Let's get you out of here. Oh! Jesus. Bye. Is there something specific about that soldier that they need him? That they're, I don't know. They just need him for some leverage. Jesus. <laughs> Red Wing, get him off our ass. Oh, it's even got a little name, Red Wing. Oh. <laughs> Oh shit. Okay, that was pretty good. <laughs> oh. That was a nice attempt. <laughs> if we get to the border, he's not gonna follow. What's up? <laughs> oh shit. Damn, he just slid right in there. Oh, that poor soldier. This guy's like, you're not worth it. This is too much work. <laughs> oh shit. He's outnumbered. Wasn't he always outnumbered? <laughs> he was just one person going in there. Oh god. Jump right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, that little jump was a little cute. Hey, Avengers! Haslema! Deathly Marty! Aishik Varsha. Anakun de Mar. Farham Bash, now next. Oh shit. I'm impressed. A lot of stuff about Steve, actually. Um, crazy, crazy conspiracy theories. But you didn't like. 
fly him to the moon? No. To the moon. Yeah, because of all places, that's where I'd want to go if I was Steve. Thanks. I'll get you back next time. No, you won't. So are you off to Washington? What are you doing there? Classified. Moon stuff. Oh. Close, close. Oh. Oh, it's Brody. A few months ago, billions of people reappeared after five years away, sending the world into turmoil. Damn, that's so crazy. I couldn't imagine like how that would actually like play out in real life. I don't know if there's ever been a greater symbol, but it's more about the man who propped it up. Oh. And he's gone. So today we honor Steve's legacy, but also we look to the future. Thank you, Captain America. It's a pretty good speech. I will give him that. But this belongs to you. Oh. Oh, I don't think Brody probably agrees with it. God, if somebody steals that. <laughs> Thanks again for coming forward with the shield, Sam. It was the right decision. No. Come on. Take a walk. <laughs> yes, I know he's not going to agree with this. Looks like you're going to make me ask. <laughs> Why didn't you take up the mantle? When Steve first told me about the shield, the first words I said were, it feels like it belongs to someone else. That someone else is Steve. Sir, he gave that to you for a reason. What, do you think Captain America just hands out his shield all willy-nilly? I don't think so. Half hour before last call? I can't, guys. I have to prep for tomorrow's session. Really? You... Oh, these people seem serious. Music's changing. <laughs> oh! Jeez! Oh. oh, so Bucky's still on about doing shit. Okay. I thought he was gonna be like in retirement and you know, Sam's gonna have to talk him into it. Please say these are bad guys. <laughs> they gotta be. Hail Hydra. Or is this like a, is this before? Oh, jeez, jeez. I, I, I didn't see anything. I didn't or see were they Hydra? That's why he said it. <laughs> oh! Okay, this was before. I was gonna say, God damn. <laughs> Oh, you just sleep on the floor. James, I asked you a question. Are you still having nightmares? Oh, God. She gave him like two seconds. <laughs> no. Oh, We've been doing this sir. long enough that I can tell when you're lying. <laughs> you're a civilian now. With your history, the government needs to know that you're not gonna... What the fuck's that? It's a condition <laughs> of your pardon. I didn't have a nightmare. <laughs> She's like, well, this is pointless. Oh, come on, really? You're gonna do the notebook thing? Why? It's passive aggressive. You don't talk, I write. <laughs> Senator Atwood. She was a hydropon for years. Helped her get into office when I was a winter soldier. And after Hydra disbanded, she continued to abuse the power I gave her. Make this go away. <laughs> All I did was give some intel to the aide to convict her, and I wasn't involved in anything else. Oh my god, <laughs> that'd be so scary. <laughs> rule number two. What was rule number two? Nobody gets hurt. It's a big one. <laughs> it's a big one. one. I didn't hurt anybody. Come on! Remember me? I promise. <laughs> Maybe a little. About rule number three. Of course, I completed rule number three. I am no longer the Winter Soldier. I am James Bucky Barnes, and you're part of my efforts to make amends. <laughs> that was kind of funny. It, uh, didn't help with the nightmares. Well, then you're not just gonna go away, ma'am. I trust people. Yeah, give me your phone. You don't have ten phone numbers on this thing. And you've been ignoring the texts from Sam. Look, you've got to nurture friendships. I am the only person you have called all week. That is so sad. Oh, Bucky! God damn. You're um... alone. You're a hundred years old. You're a hundred years old. <laughs> now that you've stopped fighting, what do you want? Peace. That is utter bullshit. <laughs> Terrible, Frank. I was an excellent soldier. 
So I saw a lot of dead bodies, and I know how that can shut you down. Oh, okay. Look, I know that you have been through a lot, but you got your mind back. You are being pardoned. I mean, these are good things. You're free. To do what? Be a gym teacher. I don't know. You could... I don't know if they would let him be a gym teacher, but... <laughs> you guys didn't order the usual, huh? Feeling like more adventurous? You should ask Kraut. Hmm. <laughs> he would like to take you out on a date, maybe to bingo or a night of pinnacle. Pinnacle. Yeah, I'm really <laughs> sorry about him. Yeah, Why do some pinnacle. <laughs> Okay. I don't know what the fuck that is. Oh! Wow. Tomorrow night then? Tomorrow night's great. <laughs> Just maybe not Pinochle. What's wrong with Pinochle? Yeah. I wouldn't see Bucky get somebody. Thank God for the old guy. All right, I like I like this old guy. Even though he's a little grumpy, it's okay. No musical. Are you daisuke datta no? He was working abroad and he was killed. The police said, wrong place, wrong time, but I will never know what really happened to him. It was strange. In here. Is Bucky gonna solve the mystery? I've been like, you just got me a date and then you drop news like that afterwards. How am I supposed to be excited now? <laughs> oh wow, Sam's just all over the place. <laughs> Uncle Sam! Okay, I was gonna say, is this where he's like from, maybe? You gotta marvel at it. Maybe being held together by duct tape and prayers. It'll be fine, it just needs to float long enough for me to sell it. <laughs> I thought we were gonna discuss if we were selling it. We did. And then you were off fighting Dr. Space Cape or whatever while I was holding it together for five long years. Now that the world is going back to normal, this thing's gotta go. We grew up on this thing. It's not just mom and dad's name on it, Sarah. This thing is a part of our family. Yeah, but boats are high maintenance. They take a lot to, you know, keep running there, Sam. What if you had money to fix it up? Make it nice so you can charter it when you're not out working the waters. Do you know how hard it was for me to come to terms with the situation? We can take a loan and consolidate everything. It'll take down your monthly. What? You think I didn't try the banks? They're in with all that big business. I won't let you down. We can turn this shit around. Trust me. Oh, I don't know who side I'm on for this. <laughs> Sound like my dad. Mm. Wait, how old are you? 106. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and she doesn't. Right? Like, they would have. I'm sure that's like news that he came from Steve's era in the 40s. Like, I'm sure everybody knew Steve was from there, and that's his best friend. I guess doesn't necessarily mean she knows. He ate, sucker. Uh. Hit. <laughs> drink. Uh, this is kind of cute. Have four. Miss. Drink. Oh my gosh. Whether you... Every time you miss, you gotta drink? Shit. Oh man, they're going hard on this game. It's been hard for him since his son died. I think not knowing how it happened is the hardest part for him. That would, it really messed him up. That would bother me too. I can't fault the man. Excuse me. Are you good? Oh, jeez. What are you doing here? How was the date? I kind of bailed, but it's fine. God, I owed you for lunch. You bailed on the date for that? <laughs> no video games. Love you. Bye. Bye. Yes, like, yeah, right, games. mom. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, maybe, what if she had to run back in for something? Maybe wait like 10 minutes. And now we're in Switzerland, okay. Heck. Oh, oh, we get masks. Well, damn, where, I need mine. Oh! Is he a, well, he's gotta have like some type of ability. He just jumped out, landed, and just kept walking. This is, this is elaborate. Oh! Oh yeah, he definitely, there's something. So I don't know how jurisdiction works here, but I don't have to place you under arrest. Oh, not this poor dude. Oh! 
my gosh. It's fine, just walk it off. <laughs> oh! Okay, well, at least he got it recorded. It's positive. <laughs> you had to suffer for it, but... You have no income over the last five years. How can you have income if you don't exist? Sarah. <laughs> I mean, she's got a point. Goddamn. I've been gone. Like several billion other people. But if you look at our plan, I have government contracts. So that's proof of earnings. And I know for a fact that we qualify for SBA loan. Under the old terms, sure. But these days, gotcha. look like everyone just showing up while well, things tighten up. I know your family has banked with us for generations, but we cannot approve you. I'm truly sorry. Shit. You don't know what happened these last five years. I was alone with two babies and I survived. I'm the one who kept that boat from sinking. Yeah, well, half the boat's mine, and so she is didn't. the house. We're not selling our family's legacy. You gonna do me like that when you know I'm right? Yup. <laughs> yup. Okay, argument done. Okay. Dude, boats are not... I feel like they're not easy and they're not cheap. <laughs> that is kind of bullshit, though, about the income for the past five years. Like she said, like, if you don't exist... <laughs> Like, I guess that's my fault. I need to watch something and call me back ASAP. Hashtag important. So this is the leader of the Flag Smashers, huh? Yeah. I thought you were supposed to be monitoring them online. I was, I did, but you know, sometimes you gotta get your hands dirty or a uh, broken orbital. <laughs> lucky that's all you got. I know. Damn, that was risky. Wait, you don't think you could be a- Look, I'll circle back to you. Let's keep this between me and you, okay? All right. Oh my God, no, I think it's a life. Better look at this. Damn it. While we love heroes who put their lives on the line to defend Earth, we also need a hero to defend this country. We need a real person who embodies America's greatest values. It is with great honor that we announce here today that the United States of America has a new hero. Uh oh. Join me in welcoming your new Captain America. Who the fuck is it? You can't just replace Steve. You can't do it just like that. What the fuck? No. That should have been you. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. And I can't wait for Bucky and Sam to meet up. Okay, yeah, so the first episode definitely caught my attention because I really do kind of want to see where everything goes and, you know, with this, like, new Captain America and what's going to happen with that and then, you know, this person that obviously has some type of abilities um, and, like, what the LAF and all that means and, like I said, seeing Bucky and Sam get back together, that, that'll be fun and hopefully Rhodey has a bigger part too. I kind of want to see more of him as well. I don't know if he was just in this episode or if he'll continually continually, continuously <laughs> pop back up and maybe help, you know, and then, you know, the whole thing with the the Asian man, I really want to know what happened to his son, and I'm sure that's related to what's going on with, like, that group and whatnot. Oh, <laughs> but anyways, yes, so I'm definitely excited, and then the fact that Bucky, I feel so bad that Bucky's struggling so bad, which I mean, I can't blame him, like, how could you not, you know what I mean, but, ah, uh, yes, so until next time, guys. Bye.